the seven segment display I made. So it counts up to five and then it scrolls to the left. And then it can also say Ben is cool. And then it does that thing with the zeros again. Okay, so now I'm gonna play a video of me explaining how I coded it. I'm not gonna go into too much detail, but a lot of my friends were asking me how I did it, so I recorded me explaining it, so it's it's not that boring. I It's very dumbed down, but yeah, so after this is gonna be how it works. Okay, so this is how it works. Over here, at the bottom of all the code, is this thing I programmed called Seven Segment Library. You can also tell that I kind of made it look fancy because I might put it on GitHub since I have a GitHub account. And if you want that, if you want it, you can comment um, in the description and I will and I will upload the code and put a link in the description so you can use it if you have an Arduino. And there's some um, stuff of how I programmed it. This is help so I can remember how to do it. Then over here is a bunch of functions. This is the around function that does the circles at the beginning here and then after that there are for writing to different common pens which is basically the different digits and for that basically I have one of the pens low which turns it into a ground pen and then the rest of them high and this is function write c1 which turns on the first ground pin and then write all which turns them all low so that they work as ground. Sorry for cutting into the video a third time but I just want to explain the reason why I change it ground to write uh, numbers and letters to it is because uh, when it's a ground it lets the current flow through to ground making the LEDs in the seven segment display light up because it sends because the Arduino sends a signal through and then if a digit is grounded then the signal that is sent through will show up on that digit and then I have numbers over here number one two three four five all the way through nine and then zero. And then I have this one that turns off all the segments, which is number off. Then I have letters. I have letter A, letter C, E, and a bunch of stuff. And then this library I coded is used for the code up here. So there's a setup that sets up the pins on my Arduino to output. And it also turns off all the digits. And then this is the code that uses the function that you use. You can see at the over here, it, tur it writes to all the digits, number zero, and then does around three times you can see zero and then goes around three times and then I um, go to write common pin four with that one function I made and then it writes number one number two number three number four number five then number zero and then over here I have loop functions to repeatedly flash multiple digits which is how I do multiple digits on screen at once I have to quickly flash them and then your eyes merge them together so you see multiple digits at once 
and here I just have a thing that right that goes to the fourth common pin and does number four waits two milliseconds goes to the third one number two you get the idea and then it turns off all the numbers and then does the same thing but makes it say Ben is cool so that's how that code works and then it just loops that oh wow you got to the end Oh, and did you also notice I am using portrait to annoy you? Yeah, it's pretty funny, right? It's not like I started recording and then didn't want to flip it back to horizontal because I forgot. Anyway, um, since you got to the end, did you like it? Because subscribe to my channel because I only have like 20 subscribers and this ran in this number that has no value means something to me i guess i don't know click it if you want i don't really care